Welcome to South Granville. Meinhardt's has been located in the South Granville business area now going on 13 plus years. We are a destination for foodies. At Meinhardt's we're purveyors of culinary discoveries. Ethnic, Mediterranean, Middle Eastern, Asian, um, whatever product it is, um, you can find it at Meinhardt's. We also have a cafe called Picnic, and it's just located next to us, a full service environment for our customers to enjoy some time while they're on South Granville. Most of the seating is along a giant picnic table, which runs right down the concourse of the restaurant. We have Williams and Sonoma across the street, and we love that. They sell cookware. Well, we sell the food that really complements the cookware, and it really becomes a, um, a full circle. Hi, welcome to William Sonoma, the place for cooks. I am going to show you a recipe from a mix of ours, our Bouchon Bakery cookie mix. Would you like one? As we say, casual fine dining, so you get some very unique food with the jambalayas and the gumbo that you aren't going to get anywhere else. It's still a very casual atmosphere, you know, anybody can come in here, uh, have a good time. South Granville has really uh, changed over the years. It's become uh, much more of a, a house and home destination, which has been key for our business. A seller of cookware and utensils and serving pieces for the everyday gourmet or professional cooks. We also have a built-in kitchen demonstration area where we host weekend events where we can show people how to cook or how to use some of our product. And then we have cooking classes throughout the week. It's a neighborhood restaurant and it's got that neighborhood feel and uh, this is my neighborhood, this is where I live. We try and make sure that the menu is evolving all the time, uh, it's changing so that you know a visit can never be the, the same menu from one week to the next. The cookbook was released last year, uh, it's, uh, it's not just a cookbook, it's a story about the restaurant, uh, the evolution of the restaurant from its conception through to where we are today. South Granville is a little unique in that there are several kitchen stores. But House of Knives fits in in the sense that they are a boutique store, even though we are a chain. We feel that we can offer you the best quality, the best price points, and we do give you sharp deals on all our products. Rangoli actually means the painted prayers of India. The concept was casual, take out food. The love behind the food is the same, the passion behind the food is the same as Vidges, but the idea is that that's a little bit more casual and people can come and take out food and they go home and enjoy the Vidges experience or, or our cuisine experience at home. What we try to do is incorporate the best techniques and the best food uh, from every Southeast Asian country that we can and present it in a way that's enjoyable for everybody. I love walking up and down Granville, uh, checking out all the new restaurants and all the regular restaurants that have been here for a while. Uh, so the clientele I think is something like myself, people that just like food, they're out for a good time. Daniel Le Chocolat Belge uh, has been in Vancouver for 28 years. We've been uh, on the South Granville area for more than 18 years now. It's the mix of quality store that you find on Granville Street that make the, for me the perfect uh, mixture to attract uh, a certain type of customers who are going to be interested with quality product. The fact that Vigis is here is a big deal. The corner of Granville and 11th or 12th, everybody knows where you are, like there's a frame of reference there. And now I think the street has become so popular and has done so well, you know, if you walk down the street, it's almost like a full family of entertainment, you know, you've got great clothing stores, you've got great restaurants that serve great food, galleries to walk around, so you've got a whole era of things. So as a family, you could really spend four or five hours here on South Granville and feel like, oh, you're in a part of a cool neighborhood. <laughs> 